Thanks, George. If you go to Scotland, you're in for a really good time. But if you have trouble with the language, here are a few phrases that might help you get by. First, the weather. If it's a day like this, you might find it described as dreary. That means dull, dreary, a little bit wet. Not surprising, this is Scotland we're talking about, not the Costa del Sol. But if it's just a light drizzle, you might hear it described as a smurr. Whereas if it's really belting down so that it bounces back up off the street, that's starting up and you will get drukit, drenched. Now the people. It's bad news if people take a scunner to you. And it's really bad news if they call you daft and really, really bad news if they call you clakit. An annoying man might be called a miaf and an annoying woman might be called a bism. That's pretty strong, almost like our own B word. If they like you, they might invite you to come awa for a bevy, come out for a drink. When you hear this at the end of a work day, you're in for a good time. When you hear it at 10 in the morning, you're in for an experience. Be careful though. If after the toast, slanche, you drink too much of the crater, whiskey, then you might end up stocious, which is really, really drunk. Still, in Scotland, that's far better than being called a sassanach, which means English. But don't worry, they really, really like Canadians. Enjoy Rabbi Burns Day, George, and lang may your lum reek. Long may your chimney smoke in prosperity. Slancha.